Hello everyone, it's IronMan67 here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to fix uh, Punk Buster if you have installed Cold War Warfare recently uh, and you got it through the sale or you have installed it through Steam and you're having trouble with Punk Buster. Alright, so first thing I want to show you, uh, first thing I want to talk to you is how to know if your Punk Buster is failing is obviously you get kicked from games by random reasons by Punk Buster and it just keeps happening. You're in games for like 20 seconds, you get kicked. And when you start, it says failed to initialize Punk Buster. That, uh, it means it's not working. So, what you want to do is open up your web browser and type in Punk Buster. And online countermeasures, go to support. Go to PB setup and click Windows 34 point window operating system Windows 3.4 version for all Windows games. Download that and when it comes up in your downloads, let me find it. Here we go. I'm gonna delete that because it's gonna mess. Oops, gonna mess up. Alright, so you want to extract all, which will take about a couple seconds. There we go. Alright, so now this is open. Just go ahead and minimize that. Alright, next you want to open up your computer. Local disk. Steam. Alright, then you want to go to Steam Apps. Common... Call to do for PB. Now normally you wouldn't have this many folders. This is what it's gonna look like when it's working. Normally you'd have Punk Buster set up Pum but PBVC and something like this. One of these two fo folders like that. Files. So what you want to do is delete them all and I might get you yeah, because for some reason it still thinks Punk Buster is setting up. Alright, so. Alright. Next, just drag this to the side, which is a cool feature. When suddenly, if you don't have it, that's okay. Um, then put it in there. Alright. Now, as soon as I click this, the video stops at the time. So I'm going to go ahead and pause the video until I get to uh, the screen where I believe it will be able to record. Alright, so basically, what happened was, was, um, I op I clicked it, and I clicked, okay, you know, allow to install, uh, I agreed to the terms of use, and then it updated. Now, normally, when you are going to update this, when you're going to use Punk Buster, uh, when you're trying to install it for the first time, it will ask to add a game. Now, when you're, if you have installed this, or haven't installed it, or planning on to, or is downloading, or whatever, um, and ask you to install Punk Buster. Just basically do what it says and then cancel because it's not going to work. It's because when you click add a game, none is there. And when you click browse, you can't find it. Um, I tried and tried and tried and you couldn't find it. So basically, you know, it's working when you can add a game and you can add Call of Duty 4. I'm going to go ahead and click add game. I don't know if it's going to, no, it didn't stop. So then you want to click check for updates and all if it's going to stop or not. No, nope, it didn't. Alright. So, it's going to update. Uh, as you can see, I'm getting a bunch of files here. going to let them update real quick. And real quick. Um, oops. Go to the way. Ugh. Well, I'll ask you guys in a second. Once this comes up. Alright. It's about halfway. And as you can see, it's adding a bunch of folders. That's how you know it's working. That's how you know it's going to work. And once you launch the game, it's, it'll tell you... It won't even ask you about Punk Buster, like, say it's not working or anything. So, it. I'm glad I figured this out. I'm glad I, I looked at the forums, but... I couldn't find anything on, like, all their solutions didn't work. 
uh, or I misunderstood them or something. But I got the idea to go ahead and delete them. So, yeah. Once that works, finish with update. Click OK, and as you can see, it says client version called it 4 And yeah, you know it's working now. Just go ahead and exit that, and then you can run your game and play on mobile. Have a ton of fun, guys. Uh, if you guys want to play with me, let me know. I'll send you my Steam, and we can have fun and play uh, Call of Duty 4. If you guys have a server, uh, that'd be awesome, because I can't figure out how to run servers. I can run some, but just certain ones, like on Call of Duty, I can't figure it out. Um, I think when you run a dedicated, you need two or something. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, one quick, quick question. How do you like my background? Yeah, designed it myself, well, sort of. I saw a tutorial, and I did it, and, yeah. I combined two um, elements of the tutorial. I added, uh, the tutorial showed me how to do this lightning sort of thing and the clouds. And another tutorial I want showed me how to do the 3D letter thing. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you did, if this was helpful, please like, subscribe, favorites really helps out, and until next time guys, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I hope this really helped. Uh, if it did, please tell your friends if they're having the same problems. Thanks.